Ace Money the name, getting paid for the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BE with handicappers. So it's a SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. Going on from Ace Money, and this is Sportsbook Robbery. This is for the 21st of August to Wednesday. We've got two games on the slate. I'm going to jump right in it. Uh, first play I'm going with is Jordan Canada rebounds over three and a half. Plus 102 on FanDuel. Playing Phoenix Mercury, the ranked 12th, that's last place, and uh, rebounds allowed to the guard position, the ranked 10th. I noticed a few months back that I it says in the numbers here, but the guards always that that play against Mercury always do well on rebounds. So I've been playing them. Um, went through these guards it's on uh, Atlanta here, and I just been watching Canada play. She, uh, I don't know why she's only played six games. I don't know if she was hurt or or what, but uh, she only played six games this year. So, uh, I like what she's been doing. Uh, she's a good uh, assist, too, but her line's at six and a half. I was going to play it, and I just took it off. She probably will go over it, but it's just one of those ones that will be real close. Um, yeah, I liked what I've seen. 60% hit rates. And like I said, she only got six games. Cleared it four out of the six. Just going over it, but... Uh, Cash the cash and let's cash up. Jordan Canada rebounds over three and a half. Let's get it. All right, uh, this is for the next game for the for the Mercury game. Uh, got two other plays I'm looking at, but there's no lines out for him yet. Uh, played her two nights ago. Uh, Sophia Cunningham. Uh, her threes. They got it over one and a half, and then as well as our rebounds, if they're at like three and a half, four. Uh, I'm dropping in the pink community if I play them, when they drop them. Uh, I'll probably pin them, pin them to the video and possibly drop in the community. But uh, next up, Atlanta Smith rebounds over five and a half. Stays at five and a half, we're playing it. She had a couple low days, but... Uh, We've been cashing her for a couple of days now. I mean, I've been cashing her all year, but I've been playing her a couple of days in a row. They're playing Vegas. Uh, believe it or not, Vegas isn't that good in rebounds. Ranked 10th, the forward position, and ranked 11th. And Leonard Smith's been killing it. He's got 80% last five games, 60% last 20. 54% for the year. Let's see. Played twice this year. She went over it once. Exceeded five and a half in six of the last seven games, averaging seven. So, yeah, once again, all signs point to go. Lena Smith rebounds. Let's get it. All right, next up, Courtney Williams points over 10.5. Uh, plus 106, FanDuel. Line over that 10.5 and, and back down to 10. They don't have it on a regular sports book for 10. 10.5 10 is 10 unless you're getting 10 plus. But uh, last two games, she's cleared this. Both games versus Washington. Nothing crazy. But uh, playing Vegas, the ranked seventh in points allowed overall uh, to the guard position. They're ranked eighth. She, uh, you, you know, it's hit or miss, believe it or not. It doesn't sound too good, right? She's either going to get a bunch of assists or... Uh, She's not going to get the bunch of assists, but she's going to score. 
the way she's been playing the last couple of days, she's been scoring. Uh, the two times worse Vegas this year, she's cleared this number, 12 and 15. I think at the 10 and a half, it's low enough to where if she's distributing, she's still going to go over it. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. They're coming off three days rest, too. So, there's been three games this year that she's had three days rest, and she's went over 10 and a half points. It's a little different ways you can break it down. That's five games. She's shooting 42%. You know, not 40% from three. She don't really shoot threes. Shoots a lot of mid-range. Uh, I got another site over here. You can see her shot charts. So shot selection for the year. Most of it's middies. And the way the opponents play defense, they're ranked ninth. So basically, every place she shoots, they don't defend well. So I'm going to give her a shot. Courtney Williams points over 10 and a half. I'd like to take this time and ask you if you could like the video. For my new viewers, please subscribe. Everyone turn the notifications on. This is where you get my plays, my live bets. Anything I do, I try to be as transparent as possible. This way you can get it. Uh, likes and comments help get the videos out there. As well as gives me feedback or lets me know what's going on. A little interaction. Uh, you cash in bets. Uh, you don't like something if you do so on and so forth but uh, i appreciate everyone let's keep it moving uh if you've been watching you already know bridget carlton three is over two and a half they bumped it back back up it's plus 142. um i play her all the time you know she go a couple of days of hitting it she miss it here and there but we've been playing it for a while and it's been very profitable uh, as long as the matchup's good and she don't seem to be in a rough patch, I'm going to continue to play it. Um, Vegas is ranked 7th and 3 is allowed to the forward position. They're ranked ninth. And by the way, she's shooting damn near 50% for the year for 3. She's averaging about 6 attempts and she's hitting 3. You know, she usually... Get one or maybe two by halftime, and then have the last two quarters to catch that third one. But she'll get it. Bridget Carlton, two and a half threes. Let's get it. Next up, I'm going with Plum. Kelsey Plum, threes over two and a half. Minus 138 FanDuel. Playing Minnesota. They're pretty good against defending the three. But, uh,. Kelsey Plum could shoot. She's uh, she's averaged around 18 points, and quite a few of them are threes. They actually just had three days off. It'll be three days, I think. 18th was the last game, and they're playing on the 21st. So uh, she'll have a couple days rest, and they're playing at home. Uh, she had a pretty rough schedule, hectic, and then... During the break, she went to the Olympics, won the gold medal, came back. They started playing instantly. So she finally had a couple of days off. They're playing at home. I think she's going to smoke this number. But, uh, yeah, she's shooting about 40% for the year. I think averaging, what, seven shots. That's the last five games. It's not the year. Yeah, averaging three for the year, about 40%. Averaging a little over eight attempts. So she puts them up there. She's getting them. I'm going to rock with it. Uh, got a bad headache. Uh, sorry if I ran through this, if it wasn't too interesting. Uh, been doing pretty well since coming back from the break. Uh, been profitable every day. Nothing crazy, but... Not losing, so that's good. It's always a good thing. Uh, 
Appreciate it, everyone. Like, comment, subscribe. Need some money to name, getting paper to game. Let's go.